Bobby Shmurda is here. I am so happy to yeah. have you. I was just saying earlier, you got enough chains for me and you. All that, all that, all that. Which one you want? Um, you got the Shmurda, you got the eight inch. Which one you want? You got eight inch Bobby, and you got Shmurda. You know, I've never actually worn a chain. I don't even know. Whichever one looks good on me, actually. Uh -huh. <laughs> you about to give me one? Hey, okay. Why, why Wait, we do the interview? Yet. Okay, dope. Why we do the interview? I just want to be as fly as you during the interview. Why we, why we do the interview? Okay, dope. Hold on, this is exciting. I get to wear a chain. We probably should have did it before the interview. But it's okay. We can have All a little moment. Oh, oh, oh thank you. <laughs> so now I could be as fly. Uh, Yo, this is dope. Is ain't nobody could rock these chains but females. That's what I'm saying. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Is this like an official moment right here? Yeah, 106 all day. I'm just trying to have your I'm just trying to live your life for real because I always see you on Instagram so lit. Like, it must be nice. I I think it's kind of crazy. I think that's why I showed them. I think I got to show them everything, what goes on. So, I like, now that I'm independent, I'm showing more of my life. I want to show everything. Like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I, I go with my cameraman just every day, and I told him we got to start throwing out vlogs. And shit yeah, like you do. You haven't done that yet? Nah, because you know, when I was with the, when I had a team, when I was right. the team, yeah. the crowd. I'm saying I can't say their names. You know what yeah. I'm saying I'm more paper. I don't want to get sued. In that. <laughs> <laughs> but What's when I was the with difference the, now, though, of you, like, you being independent? That you know everything that's going on. So, when somebody's saying that, Yo, we took we took the trash out. Like you like in the house. Somebody yeah. saying they took the trash out. You ain't home though. Right. You just call it. But when you home, you can see, nigga, ain't no trash we took it out. <laughs> Why nobody took the fucking trash out? Why nobody do the dishes? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? There's somebody just telling you that mm -hmm. and saying they did it. Mm -hmm. So now you on top, you get to see all the paperwork. You see all the papers come in, you see how the money come in. Right. You see where the um how everything works. You see how like the whole industry is broken down when you um independent because like when you're an artist Majority, ninety nine percent of the artists don't know what's going on in the industry. All they know is just yeah. When they tell them, when they when they people manager tell them rap, go rap. Mm -hmm. When the manager tell you perform, go perform. And I'm like, yo, we got to teach all the kids because my kid when I grow up, when I have kids and they come up and they want to be artists, I want them to be smart. Yeah, oh, motherfucker just sitting there robbing them and shit like that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So that's what it is. I feel like motherfuckers be thinking like, damn, what if this is my kid? Mm. I, heard, I saw, like, Soldier Boy actually said that on his IG Live the other day, and he was talking about, like, how the ODs really need to give back and, like, give, yeah. like, the younger generation but just, like, some type of, like, some guidance. Get, some does, some don't. Yeah. What mm -hmm. would you say to them that are coming up? Like, Snoop gave back to me. Snoop gave back. Like, a lot of people gave back to me. Snoop, <clears throat> a couple people gave back to me, sat down mm -hmm. to talk with me. You know what I'm saying? E-40, Snoop, um, um, Mano couple of people sat down and talked with me and you know like going independent route they told me like you on the right path you just gonna be a little harder mm. everything gonna be a little harder you gotta work harder you gotta do this now you gotta go hear yourself you gotta make these calls you gotta yeah. check there so sometimes you don't get to play too much but i got a lot of energy so i still like to play you don't get to play too much all i see on instagram is you playing all day uh, i don't and be TikTok. playing all day i be playing like once a day now <laughs> like yesterday i wasn't okay. supposed to be playing and i went and played i said yo i'm not supposed to play today but you know, <laughs> <laughs> motherfuckers still got PBS problems. It's whatever this shit called, you heard? Oh, whatever God. they call it. <laughs> I got one of those shits. <laughs> Yo, yeah. what advice did uh did Snoop give you though? That's so dope. He told me um, he told me that the things that that took them that took a lot of rappers in the 1990s to learn mm. that took them 30 years to learn. I learned in. A matter of eight or years just being in the industry, so the wow. things I told him. So now it's just about applying it now. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Huh? Him telling you that it only took you eight years in comparison to like how that long the it took him. Um, he's saying that it's gonna be harder. He says it's yeah. gonna be harder. He said it's good. He said the good thing is that they catch on. They caught on a little, a little later. Mm -hmm. I caught on a little early, but it's gonna be. It's always gonna be a fight. Mm -hmm. So it's just like that. It's like knowing that. Me having my career in my own hands and everything I do is like my decision. Right. It's better though, you know what I'm saying, than just being having my career in anybody else's hands and people just telling me anything mm -hmm. just because they won't control you and shit like that. When you write a song, do you know that it's going to go viral? No, I just do shit for moods. You like, just have fun. Like when I, like, you know, I started rapping, I yeah. started rapping on the block. Like I'm, I'm a nigga that I just start rapping anyway. Like we just, I, have, I catch a vibe and I just be like, Wow. Yeah. What's the most viral um 
some dance that you have going on right now because I know everyone's been talking about you. We that little hump. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, mm, so where did, uh, where did yeah, this uh, come from? <laughs> Shit, where did that come from? That's to get in the back dance, you heard? Yes. That's to get in the back dance but right like, there. Where in your mind were you like, yeah, this is what we going to do right here. I'm not even going to try to do it because I'm going to look cool, <laughs> okay? <laughs> The get in the back dances is is, yeah. is the is the when you when when them bitch ass niggas was talking shit, you know what I'm Ooh. saying? Then you end up snatching when they baby mama's up and like, I end up getting the back, you know what I'm saying? That's when you start end up running the racks, they talking all that shit. You end up running up them racks on their ass and that I'm getting the back, yeah. So is that like, a personal story? Yeah, the whole the whole story. <laughs> the whole thing is real. You took somebody baby mama? Uh, like a couple people baby mamas. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'm saying they played with me when I was in jail. They took my girl when I was in jail, right? Yeah. So it's only right, right? I, I sent her though. I sent her. I said, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I set her free. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Pimp name, get back. <laughs> but at what point are you going to settle down? Because what? You're in your like later 20s now. 27. Like, okay. I'm uh, 27. Yes. I will settle down at 30, at 31. 32. Is that really the number? Or? 31, 32. I feel Why like. 31, 32? I feel like that's like. I don't want to rush it just because statistics or people say rush it. Like the mid twenties is where you. I feel like mid twenties where you supposed to um experience your life. I mean mm. the whole twenties, your whole twenties experience your life. Like thirty, we start settling down. Our early thirties, you start settling down. About you have your family and shit. That's for me. Yeah, life is long. You know what I'm saying so. I don't want to. I don't want to just. I don't want to rush nothing, mm. and then be like. I still want to live and I still want to do shit and then I end up being selfish because I got kids and shit like that. Yeah. So I want to be mindful of that and wait till I'm like fully, fully, fully ready. Right. Not because everybody got kids or my cousin got kids. Nah, I babysit. You know what I'm saying? I love yeah. kids. I babysit the little motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? That's what I do. I got a bunch <laughs> of nieces and nephews but I send their ass right back home and stuff. Be, Hold on now. Wait, call your motherfucking mama. Wait, yeah. you better come get this girl. I'm about to drop, get this mama. Yo, my niece is bad as shit. So the little motherfuckers bad. Where do you think they get it from? <laughs> <laughs> Not their mamas. <laughs> you. No, well, they daddies. I think they get it from their daddies. I'm like, yo, yo, yo what the hell is wrong with y'all niggas? These little girls right. are here. <laughs> they little shmurda babies. <laughs> How were you in school? Like, were you, like, the the child was... that got in trouble a lot? That's what it's giving. <laughs> <laughs> you were? I was legendary in school. Um, you were legendary? Why is that? Um, I got kicked out, like, five Brooklyn huh. um, elementary schools. So by the For fourth, fighting or? Beating teachers, oh, no. stabbing, okay. stabbing people. Oh my god! I went to a lot of psych wards when I was young. You did? Yeah, I was like real, real bad. I joined high school in high school. I went to a juvenile. I didn't go to high school in juvenile. I mean, I mean, I go to high school outside. I never mm-hmm. been to high school in the streets. It's so crazy because you just seem like such a nice person. I can never see you like. Do That's the thing mean? is that like I'm all the way nice or I'm all the way anything. I don't do like the in the middle shit. What's your sign? Leo. I'm a Leo too. Stop playing. <laughs> That's why we're connected. That's why. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah, 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 What's yeah, your yeah. birthday? August 4th. Okay, I'm July 27th. Oh, you're August Leo, so you're yeah, toxic. Yeah, yeah no. You're very much Y'all toxic. Y'all cool. No, July, yo, July Leos are just, toxic. No, no, no. July Leo's is like, ah. Uh, Y'all like, no, we like the run, uh, nigga. We like the uh, I don't aggressive. even know what that means. The August Leo's are aggressive. <laughs> they are. And the, 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 the July Leo's, y'all like nice. But cool. we know what we want, and we're yeah. very assertive and straightforward. Yes, we don't play not. no games. No, y'all don't. Y'all don't. That's and all you? Leos, though. What? That's all Leos. Leos don't play no games. We, we don't we give a fuck. Who, yeah, period. Exactly. Yeah. So what should we see for this upcoming year? Because I feel like your life right now is just, like, taking off. Um. So I'm about to – well, I'm talking to a couple um companies right now, distribution companies, about signing this um EP. I'm about to release seven songs called Bad Boy. Okay. And then I got an uh, album – ready right after that um, yeah. ready to live so it's like the bad boy just gonna reintroduce me and then ready to live is gonna give it to him for the summer at the end of summer with okay so end of summer that's i'm what gonna end the summer with ready to live and i'm gonna start it right this month with um bad Ooh. boy okay do we have any features that you could talk about um the features on bad boy i only put one feature rowdy okay I only put rowdy, rowdy? On bad boy on the ep oh dope and seven songs so he's on one of them and six songs by myself and then ready to live is like 14 songs. You got a bunch of people. You got OT, shout out the West. You know what I'm saying? We on the yes. West, so I got to shout it out real quick. Shout out my nigga OT. You know what I'm saying? You got OT on there. You got E40 on that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Shout out my nigga yes, E40 too. Yeah, you got Yeah, okay. I yeah, got to. You know what I'm saying? I grew up on E40. I love E40 too. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, fucking, we got um, um, Quave, Meek, The Baby, um, 42 Doug, 
Rich the Kid. Oh, it's lit. Um, it's going up. Fucking Key Glock. It's a bunch of people. Yeah. Ready to Live is like fun. Just like me with a whole bunch of artists just having fun. Everything is just like turned up energy, just having fun, like Ready mm-hmm. to Live. Have shit. you connected with E40? Yeah, you know what I'm saying I be kicking it with my shit. I'm by um by Snoop all the time. Or I be um, when I come out here, I go check Snoop and them. Yeah, and um Cordell and them. They and give you them. advice like how? I they, love them. Yeah, I love because every real every, any real motherfucker will give real motherfucker advice. Like if you think about it, I've been in prison, right? Mm-hmm. And I done been in prison with a bunch of motherfuckers that I don't know motherfuckers from a hole in the wall. Okay. But real motherfuckers connect every day. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Cause motherfuckers know, like that that that's petty motherfuckers who pick like sides and all that other shit. Niggas, mm-hmm. Real motherfuckers ain't even think about no shit like that. So so you come off like that, they look at you like, ah yeah, you oh, ain't know my level, bruh, bruh. Ah, yeah, yeah, ah, yeah, yeah, ah, you gotta still <laughs> catch up. You know what I'm saying? You see, so you know what I'm saying that's why yeah. I fuck with like big dog type shit and like mm-hmm. dumb niggas. I feel right at home anytime I'm over there. Yeah, when you got out of jail, like what advice did they give you? Like. I'm sure they had my to nigga Cordell. Actually, I done made money with Cordell. You know what I'm saying? That's my nigga. Like he's really? very smart, bro. Snoop yeah. son, that nigga's smart like a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people don't know that. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, him just being just 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 fucking with him. We got a whole bunch of shit coming up too. Uh, we done dropped some NFT shit, made some money with him. Um, Snoop. I still don't understand the NFT stuff. I really what? I don't know what's lit. going on. I feel Y'all like I'm dropped. Out I made so like thirty thousand. Like fucking. Five minutes. What the fuck going That's on? Crazy. Them niggas up there what? tripping on that shit. Yeah. So it's like it basically is like um, it's like how would you say it? it's like art. So it's like okay. art. So you know how art is like um, it's like status and sometimes it gives status. Sometimes you got some people that do it to show off. Yeah. You got some people that really do it for freedom, like a metaverse, mm-hmm. like they own laws. They got their like it's not the universe. So it's like this own young world type shit. So with motherfuckers doing whatever they want, you create whatever you want type shit. So it's like a it's like a peace of mind. Hmm. It's like how did you learn how to all, to do all that? I was a bad kid, so they used to make me try to do a lot of shit when I was a kid. So <laughs> you know, <laughs> I'd be in all types of shit. You heard? I was yeah. I grew up in group homes and shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I was, I'd be in all types of shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> well, now that you're independent, I'm sure you're like an entrepreneur as well. Yeah. Are um, you have anything going on like brands um, wise or? I got I got I just signed. 10 wee strands with this company elevate that's what i'm Congrats. out here for right now actually after the, um the next interview i gotta go to the factory we gotta start doing a whole bunch of paperwork picking names groves stuff like that so i'm be out here in the west a little more now because i got the wee strand popping out here then we about to get it in new york because that shit just got licensed so okay three months might go back out there get that shit popping yeah um i got a Rental company down in Florida. I got a wow. clinic and well, I got um part ownership in the clinic in Texas. So you know, I'm just moving right now, get my shit together. I'm just moving real quick you know and I'm saying? just leveling up. Well, you well, ain't know. You know what I'm saying, oh god, listen, I only got 14 months out. Just give me 24 months out. I'm gonna show y'all something. That's amazing. I had to get, I had to shake them motherfuckers off the first year. You know what I'm saying? But <laughs> don't worry, I'm out. I'm out you know what I'm saying, it's like my first year out now. You know what I'm saying? So it's lit now. <laughs> You're kind of like a young Diddy. I feel like. Huh? You think so? Would you? They be, th- they, they be thinking I'm P Diddy. They be trying to play me like I'm P Diddy. All right. Who, who are you, know are you compared to? I get a lot of DMX, P Diddy, Fifty, and J sometimes. But I say J when I say J, I play with the J. J Wow, come. I'm like more herb. But I mm-hmm. think when I'm on my business side, when I get in those rooms and shit, mm-hmm. it's a different person to me. So it's like, well, I get like you get what you give. I guess. Right. Like, I could be like any given time. I could change. Like it be business time. I right, time business. Time of fun. Mm-hmm. It's time for ah ah. Yeah. So it's like it's time and place for everything. I know that. Mm-hmm. Where did you learn like the business savvy side? Because I feel like that's like a whole other thing. You know, I feel like that's, that's- why I say they think I'm um, like Jay. Why? Trap for he's, he's a clap for my niggas with they trapping <laughs> name. Made hey. a rag for my niggas with they trapping name. <laughs> <laughs> my niggas with me driving that. Yeah, that's why they said they think I'm like Jay, you yeah? <laughs> The trap, baby. You know what I'm saying? I'm from Brooklyn, the trap, baby. That's one thing. Jay, I respect you. I love you for it, yeah? The trap. <laughs> nah, for real. You know. Because <laughs> you think about the music game, it's just like the drug business. Huh. It's just like the drug game. Right. But it's illegal. But, it made me, but it's legal. Mm. And it's like entertainment. It's fun. Yeah. Instead of getting people high off crap, you get people high off vibes. True. And smiles, and they get smiles and stuff off of energy and yeah. entertainment, like smiling, dancing, whatever you're doing, singing, whatever. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I say music's like crack, too. So yeah. I'm like, yeah. And you were talking about smiles earlier. I heard like you said something like your smile it get, lets you get away with murder. Not for real, but like, you know. It, for it, just. <laughs> it helps me. It helps me a lot. They, they, yeah. they, like, I'll be smiling. <laughs> like, right. when I used to do shit bad, like when I was a bad kid. So when I used to do shit when I was bad, 
when I was young and I used to get caught, I'd be smiling all the time. And they'd be like, yo, what the fuck on this look? <laughs> I'd be like, ah, motherfucker, I got gotcha. you. There's got to be a Leo thing. I got you. What is that? <laughs> nah, but. When I was younger, too, when I would get in trouble, I would just smile, and then I would just, like, get away with everything. Yeah, I see. You got that smile. You got that dangerous smile right, right there. It is. It's that Leo. That's a, that's a charming. I got to watch you. We're Leo. charmers. That's the Leo shit. Say. You got to watch them, son. I'm telling you, son, them lions, son. You got to watch them, son. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a whole line, nigga. Uh-huh. Kill a whole line, niggas. Uh-huh. <laughs> summer babies. We're different. It's been the summer, so the Hoochie Daddy shorts, they're in right now. Are you rocking We got a Hoochie not? Daddy song coming out. How about that? Ooh, I'm about to go shoot a video okay. this week in um, yeah. Las Vegas. Okay. Yeah. Are you going to wear Hoochie Daddy shorts? You oh, got yeah. custom Hoochie Daddy so shorts? Got, what does that have, look we gonna, like? We gonna have, it's going to be like a big... On um, mansion, pillow fights, okay. you know, girls running around. We're going to have the hoochie daddies out there, you know what I'm saying? All the hoochie daddies going to be out from all. I need the hoochie daddies from the east, the west, the down south, the Africa hoochie daddies, hoochie daddies everywhere. I just need to know how they look <laughs> in every place, you heard? We need the Chinese hoochie daddies. We need all types of hoochie daddies outside. <laughs> You heard? Everybody go have a short sword thinking they slick. You heard? Like, you need help with the. <laughs> you need help you need, you need help with your groceries. <laughs> you don't know. Yeah, all the going to be outside. You sure you don't need no help with your girl? <laughs> nigga, nigga, on, nigga on the corner doing oh pull-ups. Nigga, knock it off. <laughs> Hoochie Daddy shorts are still in the show, like, over sundresses. Like, I thought us with sundresses, we was doing something. No, but now show. y'all with the shorts, y'all took We got to show the summer. prints. We got to show the prints. Yeah, they, they showing the cheeks. <laughs> they showing, look, they showing all, they got all their things out. We trying, we can't, you know what I'm saying? We trying to show print. That's it. Why they let, let them know what's, you know what I'm saying? We representing around this bitch. <laughs> but you don't feel like that doesn't make you look as tough? With the little shorts with your kneecaps out? I ain't out here doing it for no no niggas. I'm out here for the, I'm out here for the ladies, baby. Okay. I'm out here for the ladies. I used to shoot the street in my slippers. I ain't out here for no niggas. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I'm out here for the ladies. Where they at? You know what I'm saying? Bobby's a ladies man, okay, guys? Just stay your ass over there. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Bring all the I... girls over here. Stay your niggas over here. <laughs> stay your ass over there, <laughs> Bring your ass right here, nigga. Bring the girls, nigga. Bring your ass over here. <laughs> Fuck out of here, nigga. <laughs> Y'all niggas go hug up over there, nigga. I'm trying to hug up with the girls. Ah! <laughs> Let me I didn't know that this man was a comedian. Uh, <laughs> no idea. Hey, it kept me out of a lot of trouble, too. That's good. That's good. So how do you feel about being on the West Coast? Do you enjoy it? Do you have fun? Do you like the, the food? I love the West. Yeah. I don't, um, the food I like is the best food I like is um, Ivory. Okay. That's just like Wait, what? The ivory. The ivory. The ribs. The ivy. Oh. What's it called? <laughs> the ivy. The ivy. Yeah. Listen, I got a um, pronunciation problem, okay? I've been leaving okay. me long. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you get there? Um, I got some ribs and fries. That shit was slapping and some like um crab cakes. You came to LA and got some ribs and fries. <laughs> what am I supposed to get? Some tacos. Tacos? Right? Yeah, you gotta go to the like mom like and tacos. pop like taco. What? I can't eat them hard shells with food. Or at least Roscoe's. I would like nothing hard with my food. I like my food to be like soft. Yeah, I like bet. yeah. <laughs> like I'm saying I want I, like, I want like steak. I can't eat steak when I I need that shit as soon as I bite in it and it's like ah oh my can't gosh. eat bloody steak. I'm picky. I'm wild really? picky with food. Hell yeah. Are you You know we Leos, you know we picky. We are picky. You know but picky I like, like my food. The way I like my, I love tacos. I'm Puerto Rican, so uh, you know. Have you ever had Puerto Rican food? I like rice and beans. Rice and beans. I don't she always cooking rice and beans, walking around with the fatty. <laughs> 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 the rice and beans. <laughs> oh that that fried pork, the rice and beans, the plantains. I from the fried cheese. What you know about the fried cheese? Chill, y'all don't even leave me alone. <laughs> y'all better leave me alone, you heard? What do you know about mofongo? Have you ever had that? What's that? It's like, I probably had it, but what is it? It's, I mean, you're from New York. You should know. I ate a lot of Spanish food. What is it? Okay, so it's basically like, I don't know, different meat on top of like some dough. Like a jambalaya type shit? Kind of, yeah. Yeah. But it's I on mean, like, I don't even know how to explain like it. Like a gyro right? type of shit. I know what you're talking yeah. about. Yeah. Or jibaritos with tostones, which is like fried Ooh, she plantains gets busy. with I know meat. F- yeah, I know the f- <laughs> She gets busy, you heard? What, you heard? You heard the lingo? <laughs> she gets busy. I just seen all red peppers, green peppers flashing in my head. You hungry? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm, saying? I'm trying to put you on. You're from New York. You should be able to go somewhere. And get nah, they be having food. some shit. I be going like, I be getting like the rice con pollo. What's it oh, called? Yeah, rice con pollo. The rice con pollo. Those yeah. shits is fire. Yeah, a little something, tostones. Yeah, the um, um, yeah. Black nose, the um, what's the shit be getting at late night? With the meat in it. Oh, like the, 
the empanadas, all yes, type okay. of yeah, you, you wild. I'm hungry now. <laughs> you gotta um, take me to you gotta take me to a spot out here. Yeah, here he goes again trying to get the numbers. Oh <laughs> my god, why well, can't he you slick. see? You see, if I would have said that to a guy, would have been like, cool. You know what I said? No. To, why we can't just go out to eat? <laughs> no, it is what you it know? is. <laughs> it's okay. Why well, I just can't make you laugh? We just go out to eat. Whatever happens, whatever happens. I'm just saying. If you break our <laughs> microphone, <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> I, I don't want that. I'm just trying to spend some time. <laughs> oh, my gosh. You are so funny. All right, Bobby, what's what's next? Like we got any shows coming up? Um, Yes, we got some shows coming up. One in Texas and one in Chicago. Oh, that's where I'm from. I just booked um for July. Okay. Um, I forgot. I don't know what what's the spot the called. The Roxy, maybe? You don't know. It's okay. Nah, I just be pulling up. Yeah. I don't know a lot of you. The, the book <laughs> say, yo, we got, um, I mean, the um, booking agent called yesterday, two days ago. I said, yo, we got Texas. I mean, we got Chicago, <laughs> Texas. Uh, uh, I said, all right, whatever. We right. did. Send it. Send the deposit players. Yes. What about it. Rolling Loud? I feel like you should be there at Miami. Um, The prices wasn't right because they feel like I have enough music out. So, like, mm. the prices they be sending me, I was like, ah, I ain't, bro. I'm going to walk through for that, bro. I ain't trying to violate me like that. So, like it was that. like that. So, it was like, they, like, you know, after I got off the crowd, after I got off the crowd, yeah, you know, after I got off, I left that bitch, you know. After I left <laughs> that old, you know, that that, 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 that girl, she tried to throw dirt on my name. So, you know how that shit goes. So, I, I just got to rebuild myself. But I like that. I what? like rebuilding myself. I like challenges. Yeah. You know, I got a lot of energy. What challenges have you been facing since then? Like, especially being independent. I know you. Staying been, out yeah. of trouble. That's good. Try, try not to. Be, listen, I ain't put my hands with nobody on the label. <laughs> the label. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I'm proud of myself. Or? I ain't getting no trouble. I ain't <laughs> getting no trouble. I ain't put my hands with none of them people, you heard? I behaved, and I <laughs> now I handle it professionally. Good. If I was 19, I'd have probably been locked up on Fox 5, y'all. We don't need that. We don't need that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but I handle it professionally. I'm professional now. I see you've been in the gym. That's good. What you been working on? You got to get the legs right for the hoochie. Nah, Daddy I don't do shorts. legs. I don't do legs. That's one Wait, thing. Wait, what? I don't Why do legs. guys do that? I don't understand. I did legs one time. And I yeah. sat, I, I couldn't sit down on the toilet for like a day. I said, hell no. How do you think <laughs> Never we get. Feel? Yo, I woke up. I'm trying to walk through the toilet. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm trying to sit on the toilet. I'm like, ah, I'm trying to take a shit. Ah. I said, oh, never again. You heard my ass is oh on fire. God. I said, oh, hell no, I ain't doing that shit. I can't believe that. Like Straight I burpees. I so do burpees. Guys want, like, Whatever works for to be uh, like big, but not the lower bodies. My lower but body big <laughs> enough, baby. <You're> real <laughs> stocky like this. Walking yo, around like the Hulk. Yo, the low body big enough. I'm trying to get the top to fit. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't worried about Dan in. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> I'm straight Dan in. <laughs> what, okay, Bobby. What, what's, your, what's your morning routine look like? Because how it's can I different. get this energy that you got all it's the time? It's different every day. Yeah? What is it? What does a day in a life look like for you? Just give me like a little small glimpse. Um, sometimes I wake up. Sometimes? Sometimes I wake up. <laughs> some, sometimes I wake up with Tracy. <laughs> sometimes I wake up with Yana. <laughs> sometimes I wake up with the twins. <laughs> you know, I used to wake up around like four, five hundred niggas every day, right? Twins. For like six years straight. I'm told four, five hundred niggas eight days around six years straight. These niggas fought and these niggas stink. These niggas yelling. <laughs> it's six, seven in the morning. I gotta wake up. Small. I used to be mad in jail. I used to be mad in jail, bro. So I try to wake up next to females every day. At least you're wearing protection. Of course, come on. I'm just, I don't play none of that shit. I don't play none of that shit. Ain't listen. No, 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 no protection. Ain't no trip. You heard? No grip. No trip. I'm sorry, baby. You, know you should that? invest in probably doing your own type of branding with protection. Because it just seems like you're always with different women. <laughs> oh my God. You uh, might as well make some uh, money. Oh my God. <laughs> and I could get 10% of that. Oh uh, yeah. God. You, you see how she trying to make me sound? <laughs> If you're That's addicted, just wrong. say that. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> if you are addicted, just say that. Oh, I'm not addicted. No, I'm not addicted. I'm grown. I'm grown and honest. You can honest. be grown and still addicted. No, no, I'm grown and honest. The thing is, I'm okay. honest. A lot of people just be capping. Yeah, we don't like the cappers, though. People be out here capping. Yeah, we I date. I live my life. Mm -hmm. These motherfuckers lie. I don't act any girl. I don't lie to no girls. That's why they like me. I don't lie. I don't do none of that. I yeah. keep it 100. So if you're dating... Lakeisha one day and Tracy another. You're gonna let them know like, yeah, I'm actually talking to a bunch of different girls. They they know they talking to niggas too. 
<laughs> they think it. What the fuck? How do you know? Maybe Lakeisha is taking you serious. More serious than Tracy. No, because I told him, don't take me serious for like three years. Leave. <laughs> you did not. I, I actually, because you got to build a bond first. A bond doesn't come in six months, four months. Let's be grown. A bond comes in like years of stuff you got to go through trials and tribulations. you know it you actually takes them. five years to really get to know somebody that's what i'm saying so 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 yeah. so boom i have only had three girlfriends out of my life right mm-hmm. right because i don't do the cap shit now i could fuck with girls like six months we we going that's my dog you know what i'm saying but like to be locked in a relationship is a whole lot of shit i'm not about to, i'm not a nigga to be saying that's gonna be turning my neck every day like oh shit what the fuck shit? i can't be cheating i don't do shit like that mm. I'm, I'm too gangster for that shit yeah i don't give a fuck like, you get jealous no you you know how he looked away when he said it? That's how you know he's lying. <laughs> I don't get jealous. Yo, what, 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 why, why'd jealous. you answer look away? Where is the, mama, the answer was no. over there? What mama, I'm not a jealous person. I swear I'm not a jealous person. You You're know not. why I'm not a jealous person? I'm highly in faith. So, like, if it is, it is what it is. If and I, you do read your Bible I can't, every day. Huh? Yes, you I read do. my songs. Mm-hmm. Um, I can't be with somebody. I can't force somebody to be with me. I can't do shit like that. So, if you, mm-hmm. like, you want to leave, you got to go, baby. Any yeah. signs you got, you got to go, baby. I'm not, I can't do that. I can't, I, I'm going to feel crazy just saying yeah. and making you, nah, I can't do that. Do you like, have certain standards when it comes to dating? Do you have, like, qualifications? Yes, you got to be it? real. That's, That's why I don't date a lot of girls, because they lie. <laughs> what are you trying to say? We not real? A lot of girls is lie like no tomorrow out here nowadays. I'm like, what the fuck be going on? These stupid niggas be believing this shit. I just be, I be like stupid. I be like, all right. I be like, eh, shit, this motherfucker crazy. All right. <laughs> but you know, niggas ain't 100 nowadays. A lot of people That's ain't true. Motherfuckers ain't 100. You see how I said that and you just yeah. came over at me like that? Yeah. Nah, it doesn't mean I'm a hoe. I'm out here doing anything, but I'm, I'm living my life and I'm, I date. At I least you're aware. You know yeah, what I mean? I'm aware. So okay. me, me is like, I want somebody honest like me. Yeah. Because that's what it is. That's Protection, good. honest, being smart. I can't have nobody lying and playing again. Yeah, right. Be, because, but I understand that because when you date a certain type of um, nigga sometimes, they go through that shit. Mm. So them, bitch, them girls be traumatized and shit, and they be like, don't bring your shit over here. That yeah, traumatized nah. shit over here. You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't that nigga. who try to put me through that shit. I ain't doing that. I'm hot, happy, happy, happy smiles. The yeah. motherfucker got me. Her, she up here with the job. Like, oh, Lord. What the fuck? She's like, no, because I know. <laughs> what you know, nigga? You know me like that. Nigga, what the fuck? <laughs> How you know me? She's like, nigga, I know what y'all be doing. <laughs> what the fuck? What <laughs> <laughs> the Man, I just met you, nigga. What the fuck? You crazy ass. Oh, my God. <laughs> What about female artists? Because earlier you were talking about working with a lot of male artists. I would love to hear a female artist that you would like to work with. Hell yeah. But I think they think I'm nasty. Aye, aye, aye. All of y'all are nasty, okay? No, Every I'm day. not. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> yes. Nah, I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to work with Sincere right now. Okay. I'm supposed to see Sincere. I want to see Sincere right now. I want, I want to see Sincere. Yeah, I want to see Sincere right now. Yeah. She, she was talking some shit. I want to see Sincere. And what about uh, who else? Um, I like Lotto. I Love like that. Who, 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 who's the who's the girl? F R E E for nigga free. We be jumping out the window with the motherfucking babes in the air. Why am I drawing a blank? I have no idea. I like her. But I like her. Callie's that. dope too. Who, who's Callie? Callie? She, she has a song. Mm mm. That's like real big on TikTok. Mm-mm. No, so, no, never mind. It's literally called mm mm. But yeah, put okay. me on, put me on. I will. I, here right we go. Trying to get the number again. You I, I'm the song. Damn, so I see, no, I'm a friendly motherfucker, okay. bro. I'm joking, I'm joking. I'm joking. Yo, yo, bro, let me tell you. I used to be a motherfucker in the streets with like yeah. 12 girls around me chewing on the streets. I'd be like, I, I fuck with everybody. Girls, niggas, I'd be chilling. I'm just That's a vibe. Good. I can tell. You know I'm I can tell. I just like the people. Yeah. <laughs> I can tell you're a good person. Okay, so anything that we missed out on that you wanted to talk about? Because I feel like we've literally talked about so much stuff. Um, and I feel like there were. Is there something that we're missing? We you got, got your, your teeth done. I like them. No, I have Invisalign. Uh, yeah, thanks. All up in my nice. mouth, huh? Yeah, she's like nice, pretty smile. All right, thank you. I like her. All right, she's blushing now. Uh, I guess this is but lot. the smile pretty. The focus we will be, I gotta. Is on you, I gotta okay? say it though. But <laughs> if the smile pretty, the smile pretty. I gotta, you know. Thank I got to. You know what I'm I gotta keep it honey. I do. Okay. All right. <laughs> Anything else you would like to let us know that we didn't touch on? Um, Bad Boy EP is coming out this month. I'm Let's ready go. to go. We have a date? Um, they making a date. We we doing pre links on June 9th. I wanted to drop it on June 9th, but they say we gotta do marketing and all of this shit. You got I, it, huh? You yeah, I know, I know, I know. That's one thing I want to tell independent artists. 
Yeah. Because sometimes we want to go straight off. Right. Marketing is very important, especially in this game. Mm. Y'all have to do marketing. Y'all have to do y'all research on marketing. Please do your marketing research. Marketing. You want people to see your stuff. You want every. You want it to be everywhere. You have to do marketing. Okay. You have to do the marketing. The marketing. <laughs> Jams and Bobby Smarter. Well, I appreciate you for tapping in with me. Thank it's you. amazing. Can't wait for the key to drop. We're going to be playing it here. And of course, streaming. Get it that.